Uh, tonight, we're going to stay dry uh, overnight. In fact, the clouds have broke up quite a bit, and that'll let some sunshine out by early tomorrow morning. Uh, through the day, though, I do expect clouds to start strolling on in here. Temperatures will get back in the upper 70s through tomorrow afternoon, and a big part of the day tries to stay dry. There's the chance of an isolated shower or a thunderstorm popping up through tomorrow afternoon, mainly late afternoon, uh, but a better chance for some showers and storms later tomorrow evening, especially as we get past 10 o'clock tomorrow night. And here comes these storms in that four to five hour window. And there's uh, some of these could be rough, uh, some heavy rainfall, a gusty wind, some hail. I won't completely rule out a rotating storm moving through here overnight. So you want to be weather prepared uh, for tomorrow night. Make sure you have our Storm Team 27 weather app uh, to update you uh, through the night if anything gets out of hand. And of course, we'll be watching this and uh, tweaking it as we get closer into tomorrow night. Uh, by Wednesday morning, it's all gone across the area. In fact, Wednesday is looking really nice. A lot of sunshine expected. We'll try to dry things out. Temperatures uh, back in the 70s here, but our dry weather won't last. Uh, we're right back to some showers returning as we head on into Thursday. Uh, 51 tonight, a few clouds. Patchy fog is possible. A big part of tomorrow tries to stay dry. Sunshine in the morning, more clouds in the afternoon. Isolated shower or a thunderstorm possible late afternoon, but a good chance of showers and storms uh, tomorrow night. A Wednesday skies become mostly sunny. We're back in the upper 70s and then the cooler air settles in and so does the unsettled weather. Scattered showers expected Thursday, Friday and that isolated threat sticks around for your Mother's Day weekend along with cool temperatures. Highs in the low 60s Saturday, mid 60s for Mother's Day on Sunday.